Hey guys, this is Sotani J and this is the part two of my video. So click here for part one and this is me building the supernatural house. So in this part I started putting furniture in. So I started off with the living room. I wanted to have some little of a gothic theme for the overall house of course. But I started putting furniture from Supernatural in it. Like I made the um, TV area, the little office type desk thing area <laughs> and the couch for you know them to go reading and everything so this is a little tv area and i put a fireplace in there it's like a relaxing room and i made it all nice and everything and then i put a little table in the entrance i didn't want too much stuff to be in there just some pictures here is the um downstairs office well the first floor office room where people could just go and read and everything then I started on the dining room now I love the furniture that came with Supernatural the purple chairs are just so pretty but I tried to make it like a long table and everything so I just put a fireplace in there it has somewhat of the same type of color scheme as the living room so here's the kitchen I wanted it a little bit brighter and the um, the stove and the some other appliances that came with Supernatural um, are all that bluish color and they're like antique and everything. So I made like a little eating area in the kitchen. And this is the bathroom for the first floor. I put a tub and a shower in it just to have it. Because it was so big I wanted to fill it up so why not. So here's like a little music area in the back of the house well not the back back but like behind the living room so it's just a nice relaxing area and then I have a little reading corner so this is the first bedroom it's for the werewolf and I made it woodsy and made it green because the person that I made, made it based off of his favorite color is green so I just went off of that this is his bathroom I put a jacuzzi tub and a shower wall um, mirrors and everything put little accessories in it and then this is a little closet just put like some dog toys this is the second bedroom on the first floor this is for the fairy and it's all blue I put the fairy house some posters and some pretty stuff that was blue and just made it really cutesy and how I think a fairy room would be this is our bathroom. It's all nice and it's a nice size. It's way smaller than the one in the the other bathroom, but it's really pretty to me. And then that's her closet right next to it. So I'm just still decorating her her room. So now we are in the second floor bedroom and this is for the genie that I made and I'm pretty much wanted his room to be black, white and um, blue so it's gonna be like really modern and contemporary so he wanted to be a vocal legend so I put um, the music type theme so now we are jumping to the first level downstairs part and it's just like a little love room I don't know why but I had footage where I decorated the other parts of the house and it just kind of just glitched or something it just stopped but anyway this is the basement um, bedroom for the vampire and it's a purple theme because her favorite color is purple and I just made it really nice she wanted to be a vocal legend too so I put like a rose in there, made a little woodsy backdrop, and it's just really pretty. Put like candles everywhere, and I made a um, vampire bed on the platform. So this is her bed, I mean, oh not her bed, her bathroom, with a jacuzzi tub and a shower. It's nice and big. Put accessories in there, put like some flowers in there. And then she also has a closet too, which later I'll put... A motorcycle and everything so here um, is the alchemy room and um, this is where they study the spells and everything 
And what is missed was the club room, but I guess that will be a surprise. And the party room. So up here I just put the brooms up there. Just little things that I forgot. Oh wow, I missed the whole first floor. How did that happen? I probably have to change that, but um yeah, so that's the alchemy room. And this is where they would store nectar and everything. And I'm just putting more walls, put the decorations entrance to the alchemy room. And this is um oh wait, where did it go? <laughs> I was just putting more stuff up. But the basement below that, this is where it's going to store gems. So where my fairies find like moon rocks or rocks, gems, things like that. They can put it on display. And that's the closet I was talking about for the vampire. Her two guitars and her motorcycle. And then this is just me putting the pea shooters out. And a little bonfire thing outside. And this is the house. So I hope you've enjoyed my video of me building it. And I know it's a few rooms that hasn't been put in there. But you will see it in the virtual tour video. And there's the back. I'm just circling the house so you can see all around it. So see you later guys. Deck deck.